De tijd is gekomen om het museum te betreden. Ja. Kijken wat we hier kunnen vinden. Hier was het eerste slachtoffer gevonden. Dat klopt. Wat dat een is zonder... ...en dat hackers die controle van vehicle. Een terrorist groep claimed responsibility en er was een bloody civil war. We zijn bijzonder ver in de toekomst. <laughs> ja. This facility has been deemed compliant with the third decree, 12th amendment, on November 4th, 79 AR. Path of the Pilgrim. Hmm. Kind of an odd name yeah. for an exhibition about the collapse. Ja. Yeah. Knopjes, star okay. map. It shows various star constellations. Apparently the ones we plan to explore with some incredible new rocket engine that they were about to finish when the collapse happened. Hmm. Hmm. Er gebeuren dingen op de kaart, zeg je dat? Oeh, daarboven gaat ook wat. It's hard to think that most people had several of these in their homes once upon a time. Ja. The collapse occurred on what we now refer to as Year Zero AR. Anno Reducto. Anno Reducto. During this time, AI was involved intimately in every part of our lives. The typical family could not be sustained without it for more than a few weeks. A coalition of anti-technology, anti-globalist, and religious movements, referred to as the Human Wave, reached a critical human mass wave. a series of AI incidents across the globe. A growing fear of the singularity, mainly proposed by Voice for Human Progress, VFHP, was a contributing factor, as were proven hardware faults in widespread robotics across the globe. Mm. On June mm -hmm. 2nd, the third decree UN resolution was passed, declaring that all AI was scheduled to be discontinued over a course of 10 years. An observant reader may notice that this definition is different from the third decree we live by today, wherein CPUs are completely outlawed. This is because the third decree has been amended 12 times. However, the phasing out period for AI did not proceed as planned, and we hmm. now enter an era in which there are large... The robots uh, have the world over. But we do yeah. know that there was a massive worldwide blackout rendering most computer chips and processors in the world unusable. Contemporary scholars have theorized about what exactly caused this sudden shutdown. If it was a deliberate large-scale attack, an unintended consequence of the ongoing shutdowns, or if there could be natural causes, such as solar flares. The evidence is scarce, and the lack of global communication and infrastructure, not to mention the struggle for daily survival, has made truth-seeking in this matter extraordinarily difficult. Regardless, the end result was clear. From that day, the old world was no more. In the dark, we took our first stumbling steps as truly free humans, surrounded by our mountains of dead machines. Oké, wat doet deze knop? Zit een mens in? Oké. No idea what this is. Must have been some kind of local thing. I remember reading about some military experiment gone haywire in these parts. Maybe this is it. Wij willen informatie. Ja, man. Oeh. Hoeveel kracht hadden we al bekeken? Ik loop. Looks like this is modeled from how the world looked pre-collapse. There's no crack caused by the hyperloop failure. And the crater field is nowhere to be seen. Crater field. Ah! Looks like this is modeled... Oh, ik dacht, misschien zien we wat anders als we hem draaien. Kijk, hier is het donker. Ja. Australië is donker. Ja, oké. Wauw, dit ding moet hebben fearsome back in the day. Back in the day, wat de hel. Hij schiet op die hoevenkracht. Hij moet in het gaatje schieten. Daarin? Ja. Heb ik bedacht. Wauw. Ik weet niet waarom. Hoe zie je het voor je? Ja, dat weet ik niet. Ik kan het ding draaien? Alleen licht geven. Ik heb geen idee wat dit is. Oké. Ik denk niet extra strength. Nee, ik ga even de scanner gebruiken. Als 
zo gevreemd dat hier ja, zou niets hij hier is. Wel Niets. Die heb ik al gedaan. Ik zie niks. Wat kan er nou? Mm. Dat is vreemd. Dat is inderdaad gek. Button, button, drone, button. Dat hebben we allemaal gehad. Ja. Dat hebben we alles gehad? Ja. Behalve een healing tank. Een regeneration pod. Keep people healthy en energetic. En dan gaan we maar naar de, de ding, de morg. Mm -hmm. Om de stukjes uh, te bekijken. Ja, dan gaat die man eerst boos op ons worden, dat hij die vinger hebben meegenomen. Oh ja. <laughs> dat had waarschijnlijk anders gekund. Hé. Hey. Ik vond het wel praktisch hoor. Hij is hier. Hij is hier niet. One last waiting room before the. Oké, okay, hij is er nog niet. I think that's for collect. Misschien kunnen we vragen waar die is. Dat is die man. Horrible how much death has befallen us. I read that in a book once. A fitting quote, considering the circumstances. Oh. Patient room. Nee. Mm. Waar is die man? Uh, misschien kunnen we nog kijken of hij een kluisje had. Het is een sleuteltje. Uh, wat was dat ook alweer? Dat weet ik niet meer. Hier zo toch? Ja. Oh, dat is uh. heel iets anders. Dus oké. Okay. Oké. Okay. Okay. Misschien hebben we andere mensen uh, over hem bevraagd. Ja. Laten we de politieman even ondervragen. Hallo again, Gabriel. Hey there, can I be of assistance? So, it looks like Leonard's accident was a murder after all. Seems so, yeah. Yeah. We have to catch this psycho before he strikes again. Agreed. Goed verhaal. Wat is er eigenlijk met die baby gebeurd? Do you know who Katarina Berg is? Yeah. She may also go by the name Melinda. I don't know about Katarina, but Melinda? Dat is de naam van de schoolteacher. Ah. ah, een reden om naar de school te gaan. Ja. Positief. Fuck yeah. As far as I know, she's the only Melinda in Nordsend. That's excellent news. If you see her, take her into custody immediately. And let your colleagues know to be on the lookout too. Yes, ma'am. Dat is goed. We gaan naar school. What do you know about Melinda, the schoolteacher? Not a lot. I've seen her around with the children, but that's about it. What do you know about Leonard Dahl? We hadden eerder toen we langs de school liepen, hadden we gehoord dat ze daar hadden over Robert zijn koe. I found this among Leonard's remains. Ah, probably his key then, unless the killer dropped it in there. Misschien woont hij ook in dat gebouw. I don't know what it opens. Oké, nou ja, er was daar één deur nog. Ja. Look out there. Misschien waren zij buren. Ja, het is een school, kijk. Kijk, we naar binnen. Nu hebben wij business daar. Looks like een gezellige school. Their clothes here. Your kids left their clothes here. Waarom? Probably not worth the energy. Kastjes. I don't need to rummage through that. Altijd kastjes Nothing kijken. out of the ordinary. Mm. I doubt Katarina would hide anything in here. Too exposed. Stuff. Various books and office. Plenty of outdoor activities planned for the children. Pictures of teachers and staff decorate the wall. Some are from way back when the school was founded. No names anywhere though. There are a number of women here who could be Katarina, but it's hard to be sure without something specific to photo from Precies, dat had ik ook bedacht. Okay. Let's see if I can find any similarities between any of these women yeah. and the picture I have. Oh, right here. Same brass necklace. Mm. This has got to be her. All right, I took the picture. Perhaps someone will recognize Kijk. her. Mm. Framed photo of a Katarina. Photo of Katarina, dated a few months back. Lekker hoor. I don't need to rummage through that. Can I fit in a bin in classroom? Yeah. 
empty. Guess there are no classes today. Mm. Mm. Drawings of different plants and trees, with close-ups of their nuts, leaves, and seeds. Close-ups of their nuts, lekker. <laughs> I think the children grew these themselves. That's good. Gives them some practical skills. Let's we begin with the smart skin. Yeah. Is Carl here geweest op school? Um, maar goed, wat we wel weten is nu die foto. Dus die kunnen we dat aan mensen ik. laten zien. Ja. Ik zie dus politiebureau niet de beste plek, maar goed. Hallo again, Gabriel. Hey there, can I be of assistance? Do you recognize this woman? Sure, that's Melinda. She's. Uh, mm. She's what? She's just. Kind of cute is all. Oh yeah. Mm. I will fix with her. What a professional. Yeah man. Laten we fix hebben met iemand die verdacht is geworden in een moordonderzoek. Yeah. I had a few questions, commissary. Yeah. Zoals over je zoon die fix wil met moordenaars. Do you know who Katarina Berg is, the school teacher? She also calls herself Melinda. Sorry, I'm bad with names. Dat is handig als politieinspecteur. What do you yeah. think of Dr. Pearson? Oh, he's a fine man. Sure, a bit eccentric, but a really good physician. Treated my knee way back. Good as new. What do you think of Walter, the robot maker? He may be a little strange, that man, but he has a heart of gold. Nordson wouldn't be the same without him. Hmm. What do you think of Gabriel? My nephew is a fine officer. Nephew? He's a law and order kind of person. Stern. That was a was. Oh, law enforcement runs in the family. I wish, but so far Gabriel and I are the only ones. I've been trying to get my son to join the force for years. Mm. All he cares about is girls and fishing. Suppose mm -hmm. it could be worse. At least he brings home a fresh trout every now and then. Mm. So is Richard. <laughs> Did you know Leonard Dahl? <laughs> Richard, as you kijk. Hoi. Shout out to Richard. He can look flat spade. Are you familiar with the conduit? I believe so, yes. It's some old terrorist network connected to illegal technology, right? Yes, exactly. Wait, don't tell me these murders are terrorist related. It could be. I for sure, but if there's anything you can tell me, anything you've baby. heard or seen. Yeah. It's not baby related, you know. I think. I learned that Leonard's death wasn't an accident. He was placed in that machine after his death. Hmm. I suspected as much. Any leads on his killer? No, but it would be a strange coincidence if there was no connection to Carl and Maya. I concur. Yeah. Thanks for the update. We remain at your disposal if you need help. Any idea of what this opens? Nope. Not a clue. Thank you, Lord. Do you recognize this woman? That's the young teacher, isn't it? Yes. I found the picture in the school. I see. I don't know much else about her. Okay. Nou, That's tot zover. Very well. um, we moeten met die foto nog meer mensen ondervragen. Zoals... Uh, oh, dat huis waar je naar kijkt. Ja. Je weet wel eens waar zijn buur. Maar dan en nog... Wist hij van de baby en is dat het Nee, hey, die dude is weg. Die uh, beken ik. Ja, dat is niet productief voor me. Nee, dat weet okay. ik niet. I don't think. Okay. Hier kunnen we nog naar binnen, ja. Bij die baby. Was hier nog iets waar we. Wat? There's that red light again. Misschien moeten we die baby in leven houden ook. Misschien wel. Als in. Wel onpraktisch als we dat vergeten. The womb tank is closed. Some kind of live out. Hey, is iets mis. Eh, uh, wat was het ook alweer? Help. Ik weet het niet meer. Chamber open. Lowered pass. Hij moest wel die dingen draaien, toch? I've already done that. Oh. 
moeten we ergens lezen wat we moeten doen? Ja. Uh, help. Chamber status. Nutrient Character level. replacement oh, yeah. advice. Is nearly out of nutrients. I should keep an eye out for a replacement canister. Ja, waar gaan we dat vinden? Nutrient canister. Dat, wordt, dat is een nieuwe chat optie. Oh nee, we moeten het ding wel weer dicht doen voordat we weggaan. Chamber close. Dit is een nieuwe chat optie geworden. Ja. En waar vinden we een nutrient canister? Ik vind dat wel een mooie vraag voor de robot meneer. Oké. Okay. Om een of andere random reden. Uh, daar is niks. Uh, en maar... daar kunnen we misschien ook onze foto nog aan laten zien. Mal. Want hij is een local. Oh, oh dat ja, dat was het. Kunnen we nu wel het café in? Nee. Uh, de local, inderdaad. Goeie vraag. Goeie suggestie. Niet goede vraag. Je zult geen vraag. Not sure where that door leads. Nee. De robot, meneer. Hi there, Walter. Morning, miss. How was your first night in town? Eventful. Ja. This numb nut forgot to unplug me, so I had to listen to his snoring for nine hours. I protest, Nissa. I hardly ever sleep for more than seven. Oh well, that makes it much less like torture. I slept okay. The bed was a bit too soft for my taste. Too soft. Glad to hear it. So, what can I do for you today? No, to go. Hey, Walter. Do you happen to have any containers for liquid nutrients? Guy. Oh, I'm fresh out of those. Maya Strand. Into Maya Strand. Said she was working on a processing unit for a high-energy liquid food solution. Like people actually want to eat goo. All right. Maar die dat is dan in haar huis waarschijnlijk bij die plantenmachine. Ik weet even niet meer waar het is, maar ik weet wel. Ja, boven het museum. I don't know much about it, but man, people dropping dead left and right like this, it's getting real scary out there. Nou, zo is het. Do you know where I can find the school teacher, Melinda? I'm not sure who that is. What does she look like? Here, I found a good photo. Oh, her. I sometimes spot her off the beaten path. You do? Where? By the junk heap. Ah. Business she's got there, but I notice her sometimes when I collect parts. Is that what they're looking for? She thinks she sees her all sneaky and quick, but I've got keen eyes. Perfect. Thanks a lot, Walter. This gives us a reason to go there too. He's an asshole. That's what. Okay. Nessa thinks that guy is. It clicked the double for a while. Don't ask. Did you know Leonard Dahl? A little. He came by every now and then, buying things for the recycling center. We've been talking about automating some of the work there. Yeah. Anything out of the ordinary about him? I wouldn't say so. He was a quiet, nice guy. A real shame what happened to him. Hmm. Word travels fast. Yeah. Ever see this key before? No. First time. It looks really nice. Yeah. Okay. Onze volgende opdracht is dus ga naar de junkie. Take care. Bye bye, police lady. Bye bye, police lady. Ik stel voor dat we dat in de volgende video doen. We hebben nu dus ontdekt hoe. Uh, uh, Melinda eruit ziet. Ja. En we hebben ontdekt waar zij vaak is. Dus we gaan haar bespieden, vermoed ik. Hm? In het geniep. Ja, stiekempjes. Ja. Dus wij zien jullie graag de volgende keer. Nee, nee.